The Penrith Town Council are asking residents to come forward and nominate themselves for the upcoming council elections. Officials are confident that the people of the town are more engaged than ever with local politics. Recently, Penrith has gone through many changes and in the future we're looking forward to many more. Now these have excited a lot of passions in the town and I think there's uh, more people engaged in politics um, now in Penrith than there's ever been. What we need to do is translate that into bums on seats in council chambers and get people really getting involved with the process and making the decisions themselves. The council are eager to familiarise locals with the process of gaining a council seat so that those interested in the prospect can come forward. But the first thing you actually have to do uh, is to go to the town hall when the election's called around the 20th of March and get yourself a nomination form. Get it in by the deadline and that's you on the ballot. Now it's entirely possible that you'll be running unopposed. Uh, it's one of the unfortunate things about parishes that not enough people are coming forward. Elections can be intimidating for a lot of people. Knocking on doors, beating the streets and trying to get votes from people is putting your head above the parapet. But at parish level what I hope people will take from this is a sense that they are people in their local community representing their local community. Many residents in Penrith, though, appear unsure and tentative towards the idea, with the majority considering themselves unsuitable for the role. Well, I think they need you to be on the town council, which are all very tired. I'm not confident speaking out to other people what my thoughts are. I would think I would just be overruled by the rest of the councillors. Because I haven't got the time. I've got a disabled husband and it's t that's enough on my plate and it needs proper commitment. I would, yes. I would be very happy to run for the town council. It just needs to be more accessible for people who don't know how to go about starting or being around it, <laughs> I think. Well, I don't get involved in politics. I'm too old at 80 to go running. It's a young people's job. It's their future. But the council does have an answer to these doubts. Suitability for the town council. There's only one thing you really need, and that's a passion for Penrith. All the legal side the officers help you with, they hold your hand through everything. The uh, coming to committee meetings, sometimes you think, well, um, I'm not going to be available at that time. Town Council will go out of its way to try and get as many people into a meeting as they can. And they are also enthusiastic to improve the council's perception to the residents of Penrith and make the process of government more transparent. Uh, too often. It does seem that things are done to Penrith rather than for Penrith. I hear a lot of people complaining, oh, the council's doing this or the council's doing that. Well, the best way to, to not be annoyed with what the council's doing is to be part of the council. Now, I think greater understanding of what that involves will lead people to want to support the council. It isn't an us and them thing. It's about local Penrith people coming together and it being the community that makes the decisions rather than some faceless council. It shouldn't be like jury duty when, when people are, are forced by law to be involved in a process. It should be something people do voluntarily and want to do, but I think more people should take responsibility and take ownership of their town. And this is exactly what we want people to do, to bring to the town council the things that really interest them, make them excited, the things that they want to change. We want them to make a difference on the town council. With months to go ahead of the elections, it remains to be seen whether the people of Penrith will engage further with local government, but for now, the chance is open for those enthusiastic enough to begin to make a difference. Gira McFadgen, That's TV.